Hello, Huayin Da Jia. Also, Seo, directors, student officers, delegates, admin staff, and most respected guests. Welcome to Xiamen 2018, proudly hosted by Xiamen International School. My name is Ralph Armerink. I'm the uh, director here at uh, XIS, Xiamen International School. I am David He, your Deputy Secretary General. Hello, I am Ryan Chen, and I am the president for the committee WHO. And I'm very happy that you're all here today in this opening ceremony for our eighth Xiamun conference. After months of hard work and preparation to prepare for this event, we are finally proud to announce our eighth annual Xiamun conference. This year is the reincarnation of Xiamun. And we hope that it will be a very challenging, but also a very unique experience for all of you. With five committees and over 150 participants, we've put on a lot of work. We're expecting a lot of you guys. This will be your best Xiamun conference experience yet. I wish you all the best. Welcome to Xiamun 8. Xiamun is a leaping board to success. A foundation, interaction, and a home to many of us in XIS. Xiamun is a way of one person expressing his love for MUN, but in the best way possible. For me, uh, Xiamun is a platform for students from a multitude of different backgrounds to come together and solve problems in ways that our adult counterparts just really can't. I can learn how to do research, write resolutions, make a resolution paper to solve the issue at hand, and study a lot of world topics and got to know some solutions that could help solve this problem in the world. When you come to Xiamun, you're a brand new beginner. You might not get so much research, you might not get too much eloquence, but you, what you do get is confidence. While adults are bound by the weight of their responsibilities that come with their words, here at Xiamun, delegates are free from these burdens to explore unique and innovative solutions and reach agreements over practical issues. In Xiamun, I can meet new friends. I have made a lot of friends. I can practice my speaking skills. And it's also an important place to help me develop my researching, public speaking, and debating skills. So I really enjoy participating in MUN conferences. Xiamun means to be hope for every single delegate to have opportunity to raise awareness to other people. For me, Xiamun is my starting point. What you need to do first it's just to stand up. It's just you're gonna be able to get up to the podium and speak. And you might not know what to say, but you're gonna say it anyway. Delegates are not bound by their nationality, race, or gender, or otherwise. Everyone has an equal voice. Be able to answer questions without shivering and muttering. In many ways, it is a coalescence of what the UN strives to achieve in our world. Thus, at Shaman MUN, Model does not mean pretend. It means we are the model, that we set the example. It's not the ending that matters, it's the process. Therefore, in Xiamun, we expect you to do exactly all that you can do. And the best part is I can argue with people and still be friendly with them after the conference. Every time I go to Xiamun, it feels surreal and it just feels like the best. Xiamun is like challenging myself. Doing this program well amid of all the school works, tests, and the rigorous school program really means that you've found yourself capable enough to do whatever that comes up ahead. And most importantly, Xiamun is an opportunity for me to improve myself and eventually become a better person. Xiamun teaches you not to rely on others. It teaches you not to think too little of yourself. It teaches you to be who you need to be. This is Xiamun. We're the best conference out there. Hi, I'm Neelam, and I work at the Permanent Mission of the Kingdom of the Netherlands in New York. I cover a range of files, and most of them are related to this room right here, the Security Council, where we talk about things like peacekeeping, peacebuilding, and prevention. Among the files that I cover uh, is the climate and security file and the water, peace and security file, which are really important elements of uh, discussions in the council because it's one of the first files where you're really able to link sustainable development to peace and security. So now we're in the GA hall. Most of you will be probably working in GA committees this week. And um, one of the coolest things about this place is that every country in the United Nations has a seat at the, at the General Assembly. And this is where uh, the first committee, second committee, third, fourth, and fifth, and sixth come together. Um, it's also where all the world leaders were a couple of weeks ago for the GA week. Among the topics that I cover, climate and security, uh, it's an agenda that plays both in the Security Council as well as in the General Assembly. So when I was 10, I attended my first model United Nations conference in Canada. And since then, I attended a bunch of conferences throughout the course of my high school and university careers. As 
as much as this was my dream, I never thought it would be possible, but yet here I am. It was uh, mostly part of my uh, journey in MUN that led me to this point in my life where I decided to be a diplomat and really work on addressing the issues at the UN for real. Throughout my life, I did so many MUN conferences and some people just wondered why and why I kept doing them. Well, let me just tell you guys how important MUN is. It's the basis for the diplomatic world today and I really encourage you guys to keep working and doing MUN conferences because they let you be creative about solutions in the world. I hope you have a great time the coming days and really put a lot of energy and time into your debates. Thanks so much. On behalf of the Dais members, Welcome, welcome to Shaomun! Good. You good? <laughs> <laughs>